Hi guys, Master Cruz from Master Organizing, and today I wanted to do a really quick video about how I packed for my business trip, my three-day business trip here in Texas. So I had two carry-ons. This gray Swiss Army bag is what contains my clothing, and then I had this backpack which contains my computer, some business papers, and a purse, and the book I'm currently reading. So let's take a look on how I packed my uh, carry-on bag which contains my clothes. So at the top there I have um, designated this area to hold my underoos. I have about four pairs um, and my bras and um, my socks here. I have, um, just in case you wanted to know, I have two bras. One again that's lighter color and one's darker color. Now on the top here, um, if you watched my other how to organize your uh, luggage or traveling bag. I um, was saying, talking about how, um, you know, I have my makeup bag and then my toiletry bag here. And the first thing you want to pull out is the last thing you want to pack. So this is straight going to the bathroom. And so is my toiletry bag. So when I, you know, come into my hotel, which I am in now, this is going to go to the bathroom. And then this is going to go to the bathroom as well. Now to kind of keep a buffer for my clothing and my toiletry bag in case, you know, anything bursts or anything like that. I do have plastic pads, but um, just in case, you know, anything gets wet, I've lined my clothing um, with my running shorts to kind of, again, buffer anything that can happen because it's black and it's kind of this material. If it gets wet, it can just like slip off. So that's what's lined um, my clothing, which is underneath. So for my three-day business trip, I have two uh, business casual outfits, this dress right here, another blue dress right here, and then I have a pair, you know, a top and bottom for pajamas. I have my workout gear, my top, um, my sports bra, and then you saw my running shorts. And then I have um, an extra top and shorts uh, because I am in Texas and it's pretty hot and humid. I have a pair of shorts. Um, a pair of nicer shorts just in case. Now I've also lined um, the bag here, if you can see that, with the belts that correspond or accessorize the dresses so that it's tucked in here. And so as you can see, I've kind of, again, used the vertical folding of clothes so that I can see them and, and easily um, pull them. Now the dresses I'm actually going to hang immediately after this so that it can you know, become um, even more wrinkle free, but I've um, packed and rolled it in a way so that it's not as wrinkled um, when I wear it. Now, on as far as shoes, I brought my running shoes, which actually is what I wore at the airport, and I'm wearing the pair of jeans just in case. And I have my more business shoes, which are these flats in here in a uh, bag. And I also have my running um, cap and, and glasses here as well as an umbrella because um, there was a chance of that it might rain here in Texas. So that's that portion. And this pocket, I believe, is empty. And on the other side, I have more of my running uh, Garmin heart rate monitor. Another cool thing is, you know, sometimes you want to label your your bag is I actually have my business card laminated and I put it on my bag so that um, it won't get lost or you know if it, it does get lost uh, in this case it wasn't a big problem because it was a carry-on but I always have this on my my bags when I travel now looking into my computer bag again I just have my laptop here the book I'm currently reading and the purse kind of business purse that I will be using this great one here at the bottom um, it also holds my water, and then I have tied the electric cords up, you know, how the Mac has shown it. And then again, I've labeled my, um, my computer cord in case it ever gets mixed up with anything else. So that is that real quick video. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please share with your friends. And if you want me even more great organizing tips, join the Master Organizing Network at www masterorganizing.net. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye.